Hi guys, this is Ash here and this is my tutorial on how to install a custom recovery onto your Samsung Galaxy Note N7000. So guys, the prerequisite for this is that your phone needs to be rooted. So I have a t tutorial uh, up for that. It's going to take you about 5 minutes. So click on the link uh, in the description or annotated it onto the video and that will take you to my tutorial on how to root this phone. And once you're rooted, just come back to this tutorial and go ahead and connect your phone to the computer. Just plug a plug a USB cable in and uh, connect it. So, guys, what you do right now is, ju is you just go ahead and download uh, the Abyss kernel from um, uh, link one in the description, and uh, just open it up. Uh, navigate to the micro SD card and just uh, copy this image file to the root of the micro SD card so that it's over here. And once you've done this, you can go ahead and unplug your phone and uh, we can just move on to the phone from here. So guys, what we do right now is we go into the Play Store and we download this app called uh, Mobile Loadin. And once you get Mobile Loadin, open it up. You will be asked to whether allow or deny super user. Just click on allow, allow permissions uh, or grant permissions depending on the version. So guys, right now just, I mean, hit kernel and go to your external SD card or wherever it is that you have this image file and tap this image file and now go down and tap flash firmware continue make sure you have more than 50 percent of the battery well i don't but still just ensure for safety so we're back up right now guys so what we do now is uh head on up volume power and the home keys and hold it at the same time for about 10 seconds And once you see Samsung Galaxy Note displayed on screen, just let these keys go. So as you can see, we've got a recovery over here, a custom recovery. And if you want, you can go ahead and install custom ROMs from this or whatever. And guys, over here, what do you say? You, you're gonna tap to the right end, not tap on, tapping on this icon ex exactly is not gonna reboot or make any selections you just use the right end of the screen for enter and the left end to go back and so on I just power off the phone so guys that's pretty much it for installing a custom recovery onto your Galaxy Note so if you guys want to go ahead and flash custom ROMs onto it uh, click on the link that's annotated around the video or in the description on how to actually flash custom ROMs uh, so and that's pretty much it guys if you have any kind of questions if you have any technical queries you know you can email me or hit me up on facebook or twitter or all my contact details are in the description um you can feel free to contact me if you have any kind of, if you run into any kind of issues you shouldn't it's a pretty simple procedure anyway but no matter what kind of questions you have make sure you hit me up i'll get back to you as quick as possible uh, once again that's pretty much it guys thanks a lot for watching you guys have a great day bye bye now and before you go Please make sure you hit the like and subscribe buttons. Thanks a lot. Bye bye now.